So we um, specialise in spray drones, so we do a lot of, for a lot of the biggest growers around this area, we do different spray applications in hard to reach areas, wet areas, um, just crops that they don't want to damage their crop. We started with the little drones, but now, yeah, we've really taken off with the bigger ones, so yeah, we're flat out with them now. So we're starting to get into um, the swarm operations as well, so we can fly five drones at once. Pretty much full time doing our many different farms, probably, we range from, you know, corn, sweet potatoes, the orchards and stuff like this to even seeding and stuff so everything's automated so that it makes it more accurate so that we know exactly how much chemical we're putting on so we can reduce the chemical rate and it also we're not spreading any chemical where it doesn't need to go so yeah it's all automated we plan we map out the area um, find where the field is and all the affected areas that we need to spray and then uh, the drone just goes and sprays those areas or seeds them because it has a seeder on it as well so all we do is just mark it on the um, on the map that we've already taken on the um, on the app um, and then the drone just goes out and sprays that tree so we can just mark the tree that we want to spray or the crop that we want to spray if it's you know 10 hectares or 100 hectares sort of thing that we want treated in that area we can spray all that yeah well a lot of the stuff we do they haven't been able to reach those areas whether it's been you know the rains come in and the crops too wet to get on or they have a disease that they don't want to spread throughout the crop with their tractor with their ground rig we can come in and apply the same sort of um, chemical or with a lesser rate um, we can apply that and not spread the disease through the through the crop whereas a normal gram rig would definitely is cost effective for them and they're reducing their chemical usage too so